look okay. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, my name is Quen Ni. Um, I'm a second year PhD candidate uh, from the Sin Understanding Group at ITC. Uh, my re research mainly focuses on the uh, video request answering, which is a connection between the uh, vision and the uh, language. So today I'll give a brief uh, talk about my uh, uh, my proposed dataset. It's called HRVQA, a uh, video question answering dataset for high resolution area images. And uh, what is this dataset uh, created for? It's about uh, it's for a VQA task. So what is a VQA? It's a uh, it's a it's a really um, recent uh, emerged uh, task in the domain of computer vision. So giving an input image and a natural language question about the content of the image. The system needs to output the uh, natural language answer to this uh, image and question pairs. So how about uh, bring this task to, uh, to error images? What, what will this uh, look, looks like? Uh, here shows two uh, several examples about this uh, VQ for error images. So for for uh, imi error image, you can ask a question about the content of the image, like the how are there more buildings than vehicles in this image? Uh, where is the story tag in the in this image? There are very simple questions about the uh, concepts or the key objects in the images, but also you can ask more more high level uh, questions about the. Uh, uh, which involving the geometric science or the information. So that's why we create for the was created this dataset HRVK. So how uh, to generate this dataset? As there do not exist one uh, a large scale dataset for this task, uh, we uh, collect this dataset from the two branches, like the the image, images and the um, language. For the images, we collect the, uh, the high resolution error images from uh, open uh, data, which is provided by a really good organization supported by the Dutch government. So they provide the very high resolution error images, which is eight centimeter resolution. And uh, uh, for if you look at this uh, figure, we could see we could see the key concepts like the vehicles, buildings, or even the swimming pools very clearly. So you can ask the questions about these key uh, objects. And uh, for our dataset, we selected four main cities in in the Netherlands. They are Utrecht, Rotterdam, Enschede, and Amsterdam. So for these uh, four cities, we collect more than uh, fifty thousand images. Uh, which cover uh, about more than 400 kilo uh, square meters, which is a really large scale dataset for the uh, VQA task. And about the language part of question and answers, uh, we um, propose uh, 27 category concepts, uh, which is very common thing and uh, uh, meaning, meaningful for the uh, area images. Here shows some real examples about these uh, uh, concepts, like the uh, vehicles, ships, and some um, uh, swimming pools, and the uh, trucks, uh, stations, something like that. For this quest, for this uh, categories, we propose ten question types, uh, which covering uh, the common thing questions in the. Uh, VK like the counting problems or the ex existing problem, but also the high uh, level uh, regulation task like the uh, attribute regulation or even higher resolution, re high level reasoning. And for each question type, we propose several question templates to enlarge the quantity or the diversity of the data set. And uh, this uh, three figures shows uh, data set statistics. Um, if you look at the uh, left, left figure, it represents the distribution of answers for the 10 question types. And uh, for each question types, there are several uh, answers which are dominate, which are very common thing in the uh, error images. And the second figure shows the, uh, the average as uh, a length of the questions for this data set. And the right figure shows the percentage of different question types in this data set. 
um, which is um, very uh, uh, co covering the easy, uh, the simple questions to, and also the uh, difficult questions. So what uh, what can this data do uh, for the okay uh, for the for our community? So for uh, for this data set, we could do a very uh, uh, specific uh, task like the post disaster monitoring. So we so we collect the, the uh, images from uh, after a disaster, so we can make a quick response to this disaster like, like the flooding or the fire, and also. Uh, you could use this data set for some urban planning. Uh, like if you want to, uh, pl uh, for example, if you want to pu put a, a basketball court or, or, or a park in the, in, the in the city, so you can select the location for this city or the public facilities. So you need some high level reasoning for these uh, area images. And uh, the, another application that could be uh, potential for this data set is not using the cover. So as you can see, the VQA uh, task uh, questions could in include the um, subtask, the downstream tasks like the segmentation, uh, classification, uh, recognition, or detection uh, problems. So it could be used uh, for the net use and the cover. You can ask the questions like uh, how uh, how large are there, uh, how large how large areas are there in the for the uh, the high trees or or the, or the water sections? And uh, as the topic, uh, as the the goal of this uh, meeting is open your data. So uh, at this moment, we have finished the experiments on the on this data on this data within a, a transformer ladder walk, and uh, we have finished this job uh, this uh, work for this uh, uh, topic. And uh, our uh, paper is under review. Uh, for this uh, data set, we will do a uh, um, benchmark for the area image VQA task, and also we'll release this uh, well data set. Uh, and for this, uh, for this area images and the questions and answers, we will provide the corresponding tools for processing this data. And also we will release the pre-trained models for this task. And uh, all this data will be open for uh, this task. And uh, that's all about this uh, topic. Thank you. Thank you very much, Kun. Um, we can take one question from the audience. Maybe I can have a quick question. So uh, the, the training data set, you are, who is labeling this? Uh, uh, because you, you, you showed uh, Ten thousands of images. Yeah, uh, yeah. For the because this annotation for the this data set is about the answer to this image and question pairs, and for the question uh, for the question part, we uh, define a, a, a pool for the potential uh, questions you, you could ask for these images. As for the answer, you, we uh, build a semi-automatic scheme for this uh, image question. Peers. Like we do uh, object detection uh, work using the pre trained models and some other uh, available annotations with some transformers. Yes, that's uh, how we collect the, uh, uh, how, how we do the labeling part. Okay, yeah. okay. thank you very much. Okay, thank Thanks, you. good.